Today, I'll be showing you how you can put new grip tape on a tech deck. Right when you first buy a new tech deck, the grip tape is nice and grippy. But after using the tech deck for months or even years, you might notice the grip tape starts to get not as grippy. Here's a super simple way to change the grip tape on a tech deck for under $4. The very first thing we're gonna do is take the trucks off the tech deck. Now that the trucks are off of the board, you're going to want to peel away the old grip tape. This can sometimes be difficult if the grip tape is really old because the adhesive has kind of dried out. Once you have the grip tape off the board, you're ready to put the new grip tape on. And by new grip tape, I'm talking about sandpaper. The cool thing about sandpaper is you can buy it in all different types of grit. So you can have like a super low grit, which is gonna be super grippy and really coarse, or you can buy really high grit that's not quite as grippy. This is 220 grit sandpaper, but I recommend getting something a little bit more like 100 to 150. One more thing that's great about sandpaper is it often comes in a package of around five to 10 sheets. So you can get a lot of pieces of grip tape from just a sheet of sandpaper. You want to cut a piece of sandpaper a little bit bigger than the board. So there's multiple ways to put the sandpaper on the board for the new grip tape, but one of my favorites is to use rubber cement. Rubber cement is really nice because it's very smooth, easy to apply, and also pretty cheap. But you could even just use a hot glue gun if you really wanted to, but this definitely has the cleanest results. And once you're ready to peel this grip tape off, it also comes off pretty easy. Now you're going to want to take the paintbrush and just apply a thin coat. Once you've applied the rubber cement to the back of the grip tape, wait about five minutes, and while you're waiting, you can also put some on the actual deck of the board. The idea behind rubber cement is you want to apply it to both surfaces, let it dry, and then it's ready to be stuck together. You'll know when the rubber cement is dry when it goes matte instead of shiny. When you go down on a low angle, you can see the shiny parts and then the parts that aren't shiny, and the parts that aren't shiny is the parts that are dry. Now, wait about five minutes. Once you've let the two parts dry equally for five minutes, you're ready to put the grip tape on the board. You might often see videos of people applying grip tape, putting it on both ends like this, and then just pushing it down everywhere else. But for this method, it works a little bit better to go from end to end. And now you have the grip on the board. Now what you want to do is make an outline around where the grip tape is, and I'll be using a razor blade on the back side, just scratching it up a bit. Once you're finished, you should have an outline like this. Now what you want to do is take a razor blade or any sort of knife and carefully cut around the edges where you made the mark. Take your time on this step because this is what makes the grip tape look nice and clean. So that's it for putting the grip tape on the board. So now time to punch the holes in the grip tape. Now, whenever you wanna make the holes in the grip tape, never go from the back because that'll push the grip tape back up. Instead, take your best guess of where you think the holes are and go ahead and punch through. There we go, found one. There's the other. So that is how you put new grip tape on a tech deck. I sure hope you found this video helpful and it is amazing how much of a difference this makes, especially if you've been using old grip tape for years and you really want an upgrade. My most favorite thing about this is that you are able to get those different types of grip tape and you can also get different colors to make your board look just as cool. I love how this looks on this board, just how like the board is white and then the grip tape is also white. It just gives it a super nice clean look. Thanks for watching this video. Subscribe button is there for more content. Social media links are in the description down below. Two more videos over there and I will see you in my next video.
Oh, honey, though our friendship ceases from now on. 